my God is real, my God is real, real in my soul. My God is real, for He has worshipped me whole. His love for me is like pure gold. My God is real, for I can feel it in my soul. Greater is He that's in me, greater is He that is in me, greater is He that is in me, greater is He that is in me than He that's in the world. Greater is He that is in me, greater is He that is in me. Greater is he that is in me than he that's in the world. Greater is he, greater is he that is in me. Greater is he that is in me. Greater is he that is in me than he that's in the world. One more time. Greater is he that is in me. Greater is he that is in me. Greater is he that is in me. And he that's in the world. Sarabababa Sunday. Hallelujah. Andakarababa Sunday. Can we sing? Kevita. Okay, we start again, okay? We start again. Okay. Sitam under 
Hallelujah. If you have any needs, I want you to lift up your hands. Okay, you want prayer? Just lift it up before God. Father, in Jesus' name. We pray for every one of us here that have lifted up their hands to you. You know their problems. You know what they need, dear God. And we pray by the power of your name, by the power of the Holy Spirit, by the power of the Word of God, Hallelujah, that you bring answers tonight to hands that are lifted up. Tonight we pray for Anu's family. We pray for Biola's family. We pray for Douglas. We pray for all those who are not well. In the name of Jesus, we pray for healing to take place. We pray for the power of the Holy Spirit to heal their bodies. Also tonight we pray for the people we love, our family members, dear God. Pray for Sandra Mada. Nagayama. We bring her before you. Have mercy on her. God speak to her Lord. Your name Lord. The name of Jesus. Only let her remember one name. That is the name of Jesus. No other name. In the name of Jesus. Bless this service tonight. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. <coughs> Can be seated tonight. <laughs> so, <clears throat> pray for your pastor also, okay? <clears throat> so, this evening, <laughs> just want you to know <laughs> that our Christmas uh, Eve service 
நம்ம கிறிஸ்துமஸ் ஆராதனை வந்து கொண்டிருக்கு இஸ் ஆன் தி 24th 24th ஆம் தேதி ஆஃப் டிசம்பர் 12th ஆம் மாதம் சட்டர்டே நைட் சனி கிழமை ராத்திரி at 8 o'clock 8 மணிக்கு so it will be either here நம்ம இங்க இங்க இருக்கலாம் uh or the new place illa nam pudu aalayathukku polam so we don't know where where we will be whether in the new place or here nam pudu edathil irukka poroma inge nam onukku theriyavillai but christmas eve service christmas aaradhane is on the 24th saturday night at 8 24 sani kalama ratri so what's going to happen ena nadakka poduna is that we going to have uh, a caterer nammalku and saapade eda eda irukku so we don't need to cook நம்ம சமைக்க வேணா கேட்டர் ஆர்டர் பண்ண நோ नीड टू ब्रिंग फूड சாப்பாடு எடுத்து வர வேண்டாம் and we just have a caterer நம்ம ஒரு கேட்டர் ஆர்டர் பண்ண மாதிரி இருக்கு who uh, who uh, bring all the food எல்லாம் சாப்பாடு எடுத்து வந்துருவாங்க if it's here is upstairs இங்க நக்கன வரண்டாத மாதிரி இல்ல if it's in a new place it's just outside the church புது இடமா இருந்தா வெளிய இடம் இருக்கு தாராளமா uh, we have saw some caterers today நம்ம கேட்டர் பாத்துக்கறாங்க and most probably for the next uh, week or so we will kind of confirm அடுத்த வாரத்துல நமக்கு முடிவு பண்ணுவாங்க the caterer கேட்டர்காக amen amen so the tamil section have to give a special on that night tamil sabai vande or special paadal ga nadatha porom so you going to sing paat paada porom give testimony a saachi kudukka porom on that night anik ratri okay amen so let's bow our heads thala vanaguma father bless every giver thaga pane kudukkara ovvoru janangal aashirvadham the gifts to you of their giving amukku avangalukku mukku kudukkara avanga kodukumbodhu in jesus name we pray yesu naamathana ke chevikkiram amen amen okay we going to turn to second kings chapter 4 rendu rajakal naalavadhu adhigaram ni kaalaiyil ulladhu for those who have uh, who are in the morning service kaalaiyil irundhingala I preach on this. அத பத்தி பேசினார் போதகரே. And I begin to uh thought that it would be good to preach on this tonight as well. அதே இன்னைக்கு ராத்திரி பேச போறாரு. So on this topic it has to do with a very important subject. இது ரொம்ப மிக முக்கியமான காரியம். That is on the subject of money. பணத்தை குறித்து பேசுது. Okay. So on this subject of money இந்த பணத்தை குறித்து பேசுறதுக்கு தலைப்பு Uh, can you hear Rita? Velangada. You want to be louder a bit. <clears throat> Second Kings chapter 4. Rendu rajakal. Was 1 to 7. Onlende 7 varikum. So it is about how to get up from debts. Eppadi kadanlende namai veliyaga vendum endru solli enikku pesa pora. It's about how to get God to help us to get out from debts. Devan adilende eppadi panaka kadanlende namai veli veliya porom endru solli. So to be in debt அத பத்தி பார்க்க போனாக்க is a very very uh, difficult situation அது ஒரு மிக கஷ்டமான சூழ்நிலை especially the kind of debts that you cannot pay அந்த மாதிரி ஒரு சில கடன் பிரச்சனை நம்ம அதை தீர்க்க முடியாது in this story here in second kings chapter 4 ரெண்டா ராஜாக்கல்ல நாலுல பாத்தீங்கனாக்க this is a story about a widow woman who have two sons ஒரு விதவி இருப்பா அவளுக்கு ரெண்டு மகன் இருப்பார்கள் What happened is that the husband passed away. அவங்க கணவர் மரித்து போயிருவார்கள். And when the husband passed away, அவங்க கணவர் மரித்து போன பிறகு, looking at the word of God here, அந்த தேவன் வார்த்தையை நம்ம பார்க்கிற வேளையில, and uh, during that time, அந்த நாளில, wives are housewives. நம்ம குடும்ப பெண்கள் வந்து வீட்டு குடும்பத்தை பாத்துக்கிற ஒரு ஜனங்களா இருப்பார்கள். Wife don't go and work on the job. அவங்க வந்து வேலையை கண்டு போக மாட்டார்கள். So she is at home, she takes care of the home. அந்த குடும்பத்தை அவங்க பார்த்து கொள்வார்கள் she cleans the house she wash the clothes அதெல்லாம் கழுவி அந்த துணிமணியை தோச்சி சுத்த பண்ற வேலை தான் செய்வாங்க husband goes out to work in the morning கணவர் காலையில வேலைக்கு போன பிறகு comes back at night ராத்திரி வரும்போது she cooks the dinner அவங்க சாப்பாடு உண வாய்த்த பண்ணுவார்கள் she dress up the children அந்த பிள்ளைகளுக்கு ஆடை போட்டு so the husband is the is the is the worker is the a uh, uh, bread winner avur tha nammalku saapattukku panam than theedittu varudhu kanavara irpaargal but the bible says her husband pass away one day or naal avanga kanavar marthi poitaargal and when the husband pass away and the kanavar marthi ponaana what happens she does not have a job avangalukku appa vela illa and they are debts to be paid and the kadan avanga katta aaga vendum and she could not pay avanaal and the kadana katta mudiyavilla and what happened is that the creditors and the kavasil panam pasil pandravanga vande those whom her husband own money to 
அந்த அவங்க கணர் வந்து அந்த கடனை கொடுக்க வேண்டும் and probably her man, her husband has borrowed money for maybe for the house maybe for the children's education okay அந்த பிள்ளைங்க படிப்பு கோகியோ வீட்டுக்காக அவங்க பணம் அவங்க வாங்கி இருக்கலாம் so when the husband is working கணர் வேலை செய்யற வேலையில every month no problem மாச மாசம் அவங்களுக்கு பிரச்சனை இல்ல every month able to pay the loan அந்த கடனை அவங்களால கட்ட முடிந்தது but when her husband pass away அவங்க கணவர் மரித்து போன பிறகு there's no money to pay the loan அந்த காசை கட்ட பணத்தை கட்ட முடியாத அளவுக்கு இருக்கும்போது the bible says the 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 borrower came for the children அங்க வந்து அந்த ரெண்டு பிள்ளைகளை எடுக்கிறதுக்கு வந்திருக்காங்க the borrower say borrower says if you cannot pay me the, lo- the money நீ பணத்தை எனக்கு கொடுக்கவில்லைனா கடனை you have borrowed ninga vaangana kadana kudukka mudiyala illa i want your two boys to become my slave enna kadimi avaru rendu magalaiyala eduthu poran solli so the bible tells us this woman went to elisha in the istriyo and elisha kitta ponaaru devam manasu begin to tell elisha her problem elisha kitta poi avanga perchane solgiraanga and the bible tells that elisha begin to tell us what to do elisha solraru nee enna seiya vendum endru solraru and then she begin to obey what elisha told her to do elisha enna solraru adha padi keel parinjindu istriyo seithaarga at the end of the day and the kadisila paathumaaka she could she could pay back the she could pay back the uh, the what you call the debtors and the, the uh, creditors and the, the one who own money is too and the manasana ku kaas kuna avanukku ellathe katti mudikira alavukku devan seidaram pay back all ellathe katti mudithu because if the borrow want to take the two sons as slaves illana and rendu magani adimikulla kondu poparargal it means that they own the borrower law money avanga and the panam vandu avanga ta romba vaangi irukkargal so for the borrower to take his two her two boys to be and slaves and the panam kudukka mudiyala and rendu payanigalai eduthittu poparargal means it's no small amount of money adu or chinna காசுல கொஞ்சம் அல்ல but anyway in the matilo when she begin to obey what elisha told her to do elisha enna sonnar adapadi in this trio kill padinde the problem was solved ella perchane thindu and uh, there is more than enough she had more than enough avul kadikka mele unna nerambi irundicham panam and this is how god wants our life to be devana namba vaalkiy andha maari irukka venum endru irukkara god does not want us to be in debt நம்ம வந்து கடனுக்குள்ள வாங்க வந்து தேவனுக்கு இஷ்டம் அல்ல God does not wants you know uh, the debtors to come to your house to uh, threaten you அந்த கணக்காரங்க வந்து நம்ம வீட்டுக்கு வந்து நம்ம பயமுறுத்துறது போல like he threatened this woman அந்த இந்த ஸ்திரிய பயப்படுத்துனார்கள் God wants us to sleep soundly at night நம்ம வந்து நல்ல அமைதியா ராத்திரில தூங்குற நித்திரைக்கு போவேன்னு சொல்லி இருக்கார் God also wants you to have more than enough நமக்கு கூடமார அளவுக்கு இருக்கிற அளவுக்கு வேண்டும் என்று சொல்றார் God does not want uh, someone to throw paint at your at the door of your house red yara, color ஏற வந்து சோப் பெயிண்ட் விட்டு வாங்க கடக்காரங்க இல்ல அப்படி இருக்க வேண்டாம் God if you have debts உங்களுக்கு கடம் இருந்தா இருக்கா that you can not pay ungalukku adha katta mudiyala na god wants to uh, uh wants to help you to settle your debts even unga kadana set mudivukku varrathukku avaru odhi seivar now if you have received uh, an answer for to the for money to settle your debts nammala kadana kattrathukku nammalku oru badhil kedachirundaaka go and settle your debts ungala kadana inga poi theethirunga don't use the money for something else and panatha vera kaaryathukku neenga paaikka vendam this is very wicked idhu vandu paaka romba durmaakkara vela ennu solra okay i've heard a story about someone yaro oru thungala patti keli patta who borrowed money from someone yaar kottiye kaasu panatha vaangnaanga and uh, after borrowing that money from someone yaar kottiye vaangite he begin to do his business avar yabartha seiyaramichargal and now uh, with that money he begin to do his business avanga yabaram nalla seidu the business begin to grow nalla valandu vandathu and when the business grow panam nalla yabaram perandu vandha podu instead of uh, taking the profit avanga avangaloda velan eduthukondu panatha uh the money that he makes up from that business adile inda yabarthil nan edutha panathukku padi and pay back the the person who lends him money unakku kudutha ungalkitta andha panatha kudukama he used the money for holidays avanga undu payanam seyrathukaga paichaanga he used the money to buy gold chain for her, for his children avanga pillangalukku naga vaangrathukaga irundargal he did not use the money to pay back to the borrower and yaarukitta vaangana panatha avanga thirupi kodukavilla this is not right adu undu thavaru endru solra this is very wicked adu undu dunmaakkara vaalkai okay, if god answer your prayer devan javathukku badhil kuduthar like this woman in the istri pole the elisha told her elisha sonnar sell off all the oil and the enna ella ni vittiru 
Pay your debts. Don't use it for anything first. Don't use it for your children. Don't use it for your house. Don't use it to buy a, a, a food. Pay back what you own. And then the balance you have, use it. Okay. So God is a God that is more than enough. Our God is a good God. Amen. His name is El Shaddai. So there's few things I want to look with you tonight from this story. The first thing is this woman, the Bible tells us that when he came to Elisha, Elisha names means tonight God of my salvation. So Elisha is not God. But his name means God of salvation. It means uh, this woman in a direct way went straight to God. But anyway, she went before Elisha. And she began to remind Elisha about her husband. And verse number one. <coughs> uh, Sandra can read or not. Amen. So we find here she went to Elisha. And he says, My husband is someone who feared the Lord. He says to Elisha, Your servant, fear the Lord. So when she says that to Elisha, Elisha did not say, uh, did not like. Go against her. Elisha says, No, 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 that's not true. Your husband is not someone that, that fears the Lord. In fact, he's not afraid of God. But Elisha says to her, What shall I do for you? Okay, so Elisha agreed with the wife. That the husband is a God-fearing man. And this is the first thing. A God-fearing man. When you are a God-fearing person. This is the first key. For God to help you. To get you out from depths. Now when we talk about a God-fearing person. We are talking about Acts chapter 10. If you could turn to Acts chapter 10. Okay, because in that story. It speaks about a man named Cornelius. Cornelius is a and the Bible says to us tonight that this man Cornelius, Cornelius is also a God-fearing man. Verse number one and two. Can you read, Sandra? One or two. So here is this scripture talking about a man called Cornelius. Cornelius <coughs> and he says that this man is a very faithful man. But also is one who fear God. Okay. What's this? Oh, okay. Actually. Thank you. Okay. 
So here we see Cornelius. The Bible is describing him. In the in the in the Cornelius or or Manishano. He's a very faithful man. Rumbai visvasamulla or Manishan. And the Bible says, and one who fear God. Or Manishan, Devanikka baithe narakkar or var. So like uh, this woman's husband. In the history or the Kanavar Paula. She say, my husband fear God. And the Bible says in verse number 2 of Acts chapter 10 about what it means to fear God. The Bible says he gave generously. He's a giver. And then he prays to God always. So two things about this man who fear God. He believes in prayer. But not only he believes in prayer, but he believes in giving. So this describes this man who fears God. Someone who prays, and someone who gives. Listen to what the scripture says in verse number 3. The Bible says he had a vision of an angel. This angel came to him. Call his name Cornelius. And then Cornelius says, What is it, Lord? And listen to what the angel says to Cornelius, verse number 4. He says, Your prayers, and not just your prayers, but your giving, have come up to me. So this angel says to this man, Cornelius, 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 your prayer, but he did not just stop there, your prayer, but your giving have come up to God. Our giving uh, when we give to God, uh, it means we also fear God. And when you give to God, something can happen for you. Your name is known to God. Cornelius. Cornelius and Kupte. This angel call him Cornelius. Cornelius and Kupte. Your prayer and your giving. Is known to God. In Psalms 20. Sangidam Verse number 3. We want to read there. Because here's the prayer of David. And David there. He make he pray an interesting prayer there. He says, Number one, may the Lord answer you in the day of trouble. May the name of the God of Jacob defend you. Verse two, may, may he send you help from Heaven. Verse 2 again, strengthen you of Zion. Verse 3, Sandra, can you read? May he remember all your offerings. David is praying. To God and ask God to remember all our offerings. When this woman came before Elisha, whose name means God of Salvation, he she is reminding Elisha that my husband is a man who fears God. Which means he is a man of prayer. But not only that, he is a giver. When God speaks to you, 
நடக்கும்ேவி <laughs> அதுக்கு தான் தாவிதை ஜபிக்கிறார் மே ஹி ரிமெம்பர் ஆல் யுவர் ஆஃபரிங்ஸ் அவர் கொடுக்கிற எல்லா காரியத்தையும் நீங்க நினைவு கூறுங்க என்று சொல்லி and what this woman was doing and the history of inna seidal endra she is reminding elisha elijah mathil avar nenavu kora solugirar about the offerings that was given to the kingdom of god avar avanga kanavar kodutha ella kaanikkum pallagathil poi serrathukkaga adha nenavu kora vendum god my husband has given to 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 the building of the church and the sabikkaga avaru ivula panam kodutar endru solli he has given his tithes avaroda kaanikkai ge kodutar he has given to the poor எனக்கு <laughs> area of your depths ungalku edavad kadam irundada if you would to begin to plant seeds ninga vedai vedikka poringala giving is like planting kudukku steady nadrudha pola tha namba god can begin to help set you free from even and kattugalai ungalku vidudala kudupar amen and uh, this morning i share two examples rendu kaariyathu kurutha inda kaale vela vodaga namba kitta pangidu kondar one that happens in february ஒன்னு <laughs> பணம் <laughs> but uh, god begin to press my heart to give that money and panatha vandu nee kudum endru solli avar marthala onathnar so i didn't want to put it on my table avar mesa mele vekkama because if i put it there i might spend it and the mesa mele vachaka and panatha avar paichiruvar so i took the money and the panatha avar edutho i came for morning prayer kaale javathukku vandu i took the envelope at the back pinnalo envelope eduthu i put it inside and the ullukku pottu and i put it here anga mesa mele vechita so the money will be in the church inga sabala tha irukum endru solli so when i step down from this place inge endu avar iranga pode the song came oru paadal avarku vanchi lord pour out your spirit un parthaviye mele uthum endru solli and then two weeks later rendu vaarathukku peragu during that time and the nerathila the landlord have not renew our our renter agreement namba inga seva kekkala avanga unna adha thirupi oru varshathoda avanga unna it was like for 5 months already anju maasam aachu i am looking around for places avaru edam theedi kondirundar inga seva there's not many places here inga avalavana edam illa ipa that we could move to namba anga pinna pani porathukku okay intention is to move to a place where by the elderly don't have to climb up the stairs and vaisa namba vandu padi eradha padi kandha maari oru edatha theedi kondirundar if we look for ground floor namba keela ulladhu paathamaaka it will cause us double the amount of money we have to pay adrend pangu man kaasu nama kattu downstairs cost like 6000 7000 illa vandu 7 7000 6000 kitta varum i'm like where where we going to go inga nanga po porom nu solli yosicha panikittu irundha we if the landlord say you have to move 24 hours he would want us to move idukku sonda karanga ninga irutha mala ninga veliya avanu nu sonna akka enna pandrathu nu yosichu kondrathu if he's nasty if is bad you know avaru onnu kettavangala irundha akka but anyway i'm looking around avare sutti paathukondirundare saying where are we going to go nanga inga po porom endru solli then two weeks later irandu vaarathukku peragu this couple says so we want to talk to you oru kanavar mani vandu ungitta pesinom endru sonnaanga came up went up to the church upstairs mele rendavathu madikku kudi poi and she says we want to help the church buy a place namba sabha vandu oru sabha vaanga vendum pudhi adathukku nu avanga pesinaar so here's the amount of money we going to give ivula pana nanga kudukka porom sonnaanga is like wow you know wow oru arthapanamana karyam so much money anega panam to give as a down payment modha panatha podrathukaga to use for renovation namba adu vandu edavadhu konja seiyrathukku namba we also found a place and the adathana namba paakumbodhu the place is over there and adathala namba paathirukku there's two places ange rendu adam irukku 
And one is in uh, Festival City opposite Public Bank behind. Festival City Public Bank. Uh, that place cannot go. The, the parking fees entry is already $6. Okay, and uh, for, for members around here to go there is far. Nice place. 3,000 square feet. Uh, but we cannot go there. The only place is just here. Also, when we wanted, the, the owner says, no more already given to somebody. And we have to look again. Brother Liu, call me. Uh, earlier he says God. But he says it's, it's taken away. It's somebody. Then on the phone, I say, Liu, we're going to pray on the phone. So we pray in the name pannanga. of Jesus. Pray, 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 pray. And evening, the owner called Liu. The agent called Liu and said, hey, Ken. Na. I say, this must be God. So I went and see the place with Sabri and Liu. We felt good about that place. The place have no pillars. No columns here. Okay, and uh, and um, there's two lifts there that goes up. But it's out from that giving. When God speaks to you to give, maybe God speaks to you to give to someone. Maybe God is speaking to you to give to something. Just obey God and do it. Because your giving, it goes to heaven. And, and, and when there's prayer made for you, like David pray, may God remember all your offerings. You can go before God and remind God, God I've given to this, God I've given to India, God I've given to uh, PJ, God I've given to this person, God I've given, God I've given, God I've given. You, can, you can bring it before God and remind God. Because David here, he, he prays that uh, may God remember all your offerings. But if you don't have, you're not a giver. If you, if you don't give, there's nothing to remember you for. Prayer and offering goes together. Some people, they just pray, 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 pray. But they don't give. They don't pay their tithes. They don't, they don't give their offerings. Prayer and offering goes together. Because we see here, when the angel saw Cornelius, your prayer and offering. I want to look secondly, back to Second Kings. Chapter 4. Verse number 4 and 5. What this woman did. What Elijah told her to do. Sandra, could you read? Okay. Verse 4. Now here we find that Elijah told her to do something. After she had done all that Elijah told her to do, Elijah asked her to go inside the room, shut the door, and then begin to pour it into those vessels. <coughs> Into the pots. 
So she went in verse number 5. அஞ்சாவது வசனத்தில் சொல்து அவ அறைக்குள்ள போய் close the door. கதவுகளை சாத்தி பூட்டி கொண்டு No no. Shut the door. Go inside your room and shut the door is a very um common uh what you call asking. ஆலயத்து ரூமுக்குள்ள போயிட்டு அடைய சாத்தி என்று சொல்றாரு மிக சர்வசாதாரண ஒரு காரியம். You find that this is what Jesus also tells us to do. இது இயேசு கிறிஸ்து இது நம்ம மத்தியில சொல்லி இருக்கிறார். Jesus says when you pray நீங்க ஜெபம் பண்ணீங்கனா go to the room உன் அறைக்குள்ள போய் shut the door உன் கதவை சாத்தி கொண்டு lock it நீ பூட்டிட்டு you go and talk to your father உன் தகப்பன் மத்தியில நீ போய் பேசு என்று சொல்றார் you and your father in heaven நீ நோ பலகத்தை தேவனோ பேசுங்க என்று சொல்றார் nobody knows you inside praying நீங்க என்ன ஜெபம் பண்றன்னு யாருக்கும் தெரியாது and god sees ஆனா தேவனோ பார்க்கிறார் you praying in private in your room நீ ரூம்ல தனிப்பட்ட மலைக்கு ஜெபம் பண்ணும்போது he will openly reward you அவர் உங்களுக்கு கதவை திறந்து உங்களுக்கு அதிகாரம் கொடுப்பார் now we see that elijah told her இலாஜா ஒரு மத்தியில சொல்ற இஸ்ரே மத்தியில only you go inside நீ மட்டும் அறைக்குள்ள போய் என்று சொன்னார் not even your two sons ஒரு ரெண்டு பிள்ளைங்க இல்ல your two sons are outside ஒரு ரெண்டு பிள்ளங்கள வெளிய இருக்கார்கள் you go in நீ அறைக்குள்ள போய் and you do what i tell you to do நான் என்ன சொன்னேனோ அதுபடி நீ செய்ய என்று சொல்லி jesus told us இயேசு நம்ம மத்தியில சொல்கிறார் if we want god to reward us நம்மளுக்கு வர வர நம்மளுக்கு அதிகாரம் கொடுக்க போறானாக்க when we are in need நம்மளுக்கு தேவை இருக்கு என்று சொன்னார் he asks us அவர் நம்ம மத்தியில கேக்குறார் to go into our room நம்ம அறைக்குள்ள போய் shut the door கதவுகள பூட்டி and you pray to god your father நம்ம தகப்பன் மத்திய நம்ம ஜெபிக்க வேண்டும் and your father will hear you நம்ம தகப்பனா அத கேட்டு and will answer your prayers நம்ம ஜெபத்துக்கு பதில் கொடுப்பார் so this is how this woman இப்படி தான் இதே போல இந்த ஸ்ட்ரீய got her problem solved அது எல்லா பிரச்சனையும் தீந்ததா okay this is how she she solved her debt problem அப்பதான் அவங்க கடனை அவங்க தீத்தார்கள் after all the pots are filled with oil அங்க இருக்கிற அந்த கூஜா எல்லாமே என்னையால நிரம்பனனால she sold it அது எல்லastype விட்டு she pay off her debts அவங்க எல்லா கடனை கட்டனார்கள் and the balance she has அங்க இருக்கிற அந்த மிச்சமானது god always gives you balance amen தேவன் என்னைக்கே நம்ம மிச்சம் கொடுப்பார் amen there's always more than enough அது என்னைக்கு கூடுமாற அளவுக்கு நிரம்பி இருக்கும் remember the story of the boy with two fish and five loaves of bread ஒரு ரெண்டு மீனு ஐந்து அப்பா உள்ள ஒரு மனுஷ அந்த பையனை கொடுத்து நினைவு கூறுங்க after jesus bless it இயேசு அதை ஆசீர்வதித்த பிறகு and fed 20000 people அந்த 20000 ஜனங்கள் மத்தியில there were 12 basket full of Uh, bread remaining anga micho appangal 12 kooda alavukku nerambi irundathu god always give us more than enough enikka deva namal kudumara alavukku kudukkara deva so tonight indha ratri velala go into your room unga arikkulla poi and remind god devan mathra ninave korunga about all that you have given to god inga enna avarku kuduthingalo ella kaariyamo amen amen because here we find idhil enna paakkarom that god solve a problem avlal perchina history match thindathu and god can solve yours deva namba perchina thite par amen amen uh, i want you to stand to your feet anivar eldu vanam anipama i want to pray this prayer david pray david sonna and javatha nikku jom padara psalms chapter 20 sangeetham 20th vasana i want to pray this on you amma mathil avar jeevikka pora tonight in this place inda edathila want you to lift up your hands karangala vaithunga remember ninave koorungal if god help you devanumukku odivi seidhar when god help you devanumukku odivi seyumbodhu when god give the money to you devanumukku kodukumbodhu panatha you have you pay for your debts ungal kadana neenga theekka vendum don't take the money and the panatha eduthu neenga and use for something else vela kaariyathukaga neenga payanpaduthadhu it is not right adhu vandu sari illa endru solra god give when god give to you devanumukku kodukumbodhu you pay it off adhu kadana kodutha Psalms 20 Sangeetham 20 May the Lord answer you Devan unga javathukku badal kodutha In the day of trouble Ungal ella perchanaiga mathila pombodhu May the name of the God of Devan, Jacob Devan Devan Jacob and Devan naamathukkaga varigiram protect you Ungalku padukappu kodukka May he send you help Avar ungal vadivi avaru kettu from heaven Palagathilende May he remember all your offerings. நீ கொடுக்கிற எல்லா காணிக்கையும் அவர் நினைவு கூற வேண்டும் என்று. In Jesus Christ name. இயேசு கிறிஸ்து நாமத்தில் நாங்கள் ஜெபிக்கிறோம். I pray. ஜெபிக்கிறோம். Amen. Amen. Let's give a big clap to the Lord. உச்சகத்தோட கரங்க தட்டுங்க. Amen.